Hey, Alex with windowcleaner.com. Here I have our little zero pressure gauge. I'm gonna show you how to install this on an X2. Nice adding a pressure gauge to a system like this because you get to know the incoming pressure before it hits your ROs. So we're gonna take the hose that goes from the pre-filter, the carbon pre-filter in the back that feeds the two ROs. And we're gonna install this right here. Something to know about these metal push fittings is you really want to make sure that they're pushed in all the way and they're pushed in secure. If you listen really carefully, there's a pretty good clicky here. It's very affirmative, you know when you're in. So what we're going to do is take this tubing on the back here, cut about one inch out. We're going to install this right about this high. I'm even going to leave the tubing connected to the ROs to do this. And I'm going to use a pair of uh, Ronin multi-cutters cut about an inch and a half from the top, and then remove about one inch of this tube. No going back now. Okay, I'm gonna feed this tube through the front. And again, we'll listen for that real good click. We're in, take the tube from the top, feed it in, get a nice affirmative click. Now what we've done is simply added a pressure gauge to this X2. Now we know the pressure coming from the pre-filter before it hits the ROs. Very simple to install, nice little add-on. It's the zero pressure gauge. Check it out at windowcleaner.com.